Toko will throw it quickly and complete. No! Finishing short is just like, and you know you were right there, and you know that a lot of those things were just simple mistakes and like those kind of compounded. Obviously, last year we weren't good enough to win the national championship. So what can we add? What can we change? What can we do different this year to actually go out and win it? With 18 returning starters, rebuild is not the answer for Mines football. Rookie head coach Pete Sturbeck prefers the word reset. Unfinished business is the theme at fall camp. Yeah, we're hungry. I mean, there's no doubt about it. Um, we feel like we're the standard. We're one of the standards in the country, and, and uh, we want to get to that perennial power status, and we're not there yet. This could be the team that puts the program over the top. Armed with Harlan Hill Award winner John Matoka, the offense is poised to pick up where it left off, and the ore digger D figures to give opposing quarterbacks fits, but Sturbeck wants his players to see the big picture. We've had some good runs and, and we've had a couple great years, but we haven't reached the ultimate goal. Yeah. Um, we got a bunch of guys. We got 17 sixth year seniors that could be out working. These seniors made a business decision. They turned down the money guaranteed to Mines graduates to go after something that's priceless. The national championship is the goal, and we have a lot of, you mentioned those 18 starters, we have a lot of senior leadership coming back. So I think that we're trying to take advantage of every single opportunity, not just on the field, in order to really appreciate, be grateful, and win this last year that we can. We can work for the rest of our lives. We only can play football for so much time, and it's, it's, a, it's a privilege. We talk about that all the time, it's a privilege. And this Mines team is hoping to make the most of it. Reporting from Golden, I'm Aaron Anderson.